Good to have all of y'all gathered here today on this Mother's Day, or what we call in our house, annual tie day. And uh, so my, uh, my folks are in the service today, so don't tell my mom this is the only day of, of the year that I actually wear a tie. Just let her know that this <laughs> is... Glad to have all of the moms present with us today. Now, one of the things that's so beautiful about really being in a deliberately multi-generational church is the opportunity all on the same day to do a baby dedication and also celebrate a very special birthday. Vera Mae Siptak turns 90 today. Vera Mae, would you stand please where are you? She is right there. Members of her family with her. So, Vera Mae, we celebrate your 90th birthday, and this one I have in my hands is uh, about four and a half months into this life, and his name is Andrew Walter Hallman, and he was born to Krista and Josh Hallman on December 25th, uh, a Christmas baby. Now, these are some very significant names that Andrew has. Andrew's a Greek word. It means manly or strong or courageous. And uh, it connects with the other names that he's got as well because his middle name is Walter. And Walter is an old German name. It means commander or leader. And it's also a family name from Andrew's father, Joshua Walter Hallman, and Andrew's great-grandfather, Robert Walter Hallman. And Hallman is, a, is a, an English variation of a German name with the meaning servant. And so this one I have in my hands by his very name is Strong Servant Leader. And uh, isn't that exactly what Jesus challenged us to be? And so the Bible verse I want to give to Andrew Walter Holman is Psalm 31, verse 24. So be strong and take courage, all you who put your hope in the Lord. Heavenly Father, we pray that you would bless Andrew, that you would help him to grow strong in body, to grow strong in, uh, in emotions, to grow strong in his spirit that he would learn to put his hope in you. And we pray that you would uh, be with his parents as they are now not only just husband and wife to each other, as significant as that is, but also mom and dad to this gift you've given them. And we pray that you would help us as their church family to be with them as they raise him in what the Bible calls the nurture and admonition of the Lord. And we pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. 